A crack in the outer containment building of the Davis Massey nuclear reactor could keep that power plant shut down longer than expected. Workers in the process of replacing the plant's reactor had discovered that crack this week. WTO 11's Matt Wright has more on this developing story from Oak Harbor. The cracking was found in a concrete building that surrounds the nuclear reactor. You can see from this demo, it's made of about two and a half feet of concrete. Inside, there's rebar, and the cracking was found running along vertical rebar. The crack is as much as 30 feet long in the concrete outer shield building. The building is meant to protect the reactor from outside forces, like a tornado or even an aircraft. Because safety is our top priority, we take all discoveries such as this very seriously. Workers using hydro demolition cut a hole in the shield building to make way for a new reactor head. Engineers then discovered the crack along the hole's edge. The crack indications appear to be in the concrete running vertically along this rebar uh, towards the outer layer of the building. First Energy says there's no safety threat. An inner steel vessel containing the reactor remains sealed, and the plant has been shut down for nearly two weeks. First Energy is replacing the current reactor head after cracks were found in fuel rod nozzles. We continue to move forward with the work to do so, uh, and at this time there's no impact on that schedule. The Nuclear Regulatory Commission is monitoring the situation. It sent a concrete expert to the plant to assist inspectors already on site. It plans to conduct an independent analysis of the crack. Those who live in the shadow of Davis Bessie say any problem can be alarming. I don't give it a whole lot of thought, but once in a while when you hear there's something wrong with it, it concerns you. They're on top of stuff and it's, you know, it's regulated, so that's a good thing. Davis Bessie is scheduled to be back online by mid-November, but that could be delayed. I hope they get it fixed in a hurry. <laughs> First Energy says it won't restart the plant until the crack is fixed. In Oak Harbor, Matt Wright, WTOL 11.